nerds? On today's episode of the Nerd Bros, we are opening this month's collector case, which theme is Dark Horse. Uh, now it could have a signature inside. We have our fingers crossed. And, and uh, an extra pump. Oh, and an extra pump. So let's go ahead and uh, open this up here. All right, we'll have all the pricing and details down below for the collector's case. So opening it up, you see nothing. Just collector case. You see the t-shirt, so they have it well hidden. Right. So I'll set the t-shirt to the side. Wow, is that ever Game of Thrones? Apparently. Mm -hmm. I got the question mark. Oh, okay. So the pop. Obviously, it's a pop. It's a question mark. Why is it the mystery pop? <laughs> I should know, so it's a mystery. <laughs> oh, I'm looking for, for something. I see something. So we got a Logan. That's kind of pop. off theme. Yeah, just a bit. But it is a mystery pop, so you don't know what you're going to get. That could be the actual one. Alright, so I will start from the same side. So we have a Game of Thrones Lannister Sigil Mug Hear Me Roar Lannister. Open. Yeah. Looks ceramic. Oh, no, it is what regular mugs are made out of. Got it? <laughs> no, you don't have it. No, 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 I'm just seeing if it's the Legacy Collection for the other one I have. You just move everything so much and it's all Is it like a same collection? Like it, though. Next, we got the Hound from Legacy Collection Game of Thrones number three. The Funko licensed product. That's awesome. Next, we have the game. Are you ready to play? Includes the expansion, the game on fire. Uh, the game is no toy. You and your friends will have to work together if you're going to survive. How well can you coordinate your movements without talking? Can you trust your friends and make the right move? Quick thinking and spitfire cooperation will make you or break you. This time, the game is fighting back. The all-new on fire expansion will make the challenge greater than you have ever faced. Sounds like something that would come in like a horror blog. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'll just take all this out. It's just cards and things. Do you want to do one card? I'll do the other. Oh, so we'll show that. Yeah. So next we have Game of Thrones, All Men Must Die. Uh, playing cards. We did not get the signature. Nope. You got the mystery pop. No, it always comes with a pop. Oh, does it? Yeah. So next up, we got uh, Game of Thrones mystery minis. That looks like it. Contains one of twelve. Construction. It's gonna suck if we both get the exact same one. No opening thing. No, I guess not. Here's a mini. Yeah, well, I've gotten these before. I think it was Marvel. Oh, yeah, you had the Walking Dead one. Oh, Walking Dead. That's what it was. Okay, so I have a spear. I have a body. Body. <laughs> you have a body. But Starts and crafts on the nerd bros. Doesn't want to go together. That is really stiff, eh? All right, welcome back. Um, 
And I was, what, 20 minutes to put these together? No. Not, not exactly, but uh, it took a while. Dave's was a little easier. Mine, mine was really stiff. Well, I um, also found out um, the way the figurine is in the picture is the way the pieces have to go in. Yeah, and I can't get the one piece on, on mine. Oh, I know that piece. What is it? Oh, it goes. It goes on. On the side, it's a sheath. Yeah, yeah it just wouldn't stay on. So. Did you put it on the way it was in yeah. the picture? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it just doesn't want to stay. It's on. literally, if it is not the way in the picture, as we found out, it will not at all go on. All right, so we got three sets of Lord of the Ring playing cards. There's one for you. There's one for you. There's one for me. Uh, they could have memorabilia cards and autographs in them. So let's go ahead and open them up and see if we got some autographs. Alright. Alright, so. Bilbo's Last Adventure. The Lord of the Rings? Oh, they are Lord of the Rings. I'm still stuck on Game of Thrones. Okay. Uh, so it's we like have... I don't have a memorabilia card or a signature. I. Oh, maybe not. Because I have gold writing on my Yeah, head. they're all the same. So there's that. There's that. There's that. There's that. And there's that. No more fuck with this guy. I don't like doing things half completed. It's not supposed to be like that. It's supposed to be turned to the side and up straight. Sorry, you know me and my OCD. All right. Uh, let's go ahead and do the t-shirt. Hold on. Mm -hmm. Worry about that afterwards. OCD. And now his head straight. Instead of looking like he got punched in the side of the skull. <laughs> ah. get a dark horse. Dot com. Comics. 30 years. Hmm. Nice. Cool. Alright. What did you like for this box? Uh, I'm going with the X-Men pop. And I'm going with the Game of Thrones. Just because they're my two favorite things. So. I like the entire box. Other than the t-shirt, yeah. Didn't like the t-shirt? No, not really. But, yeah. <laughs> oh, no, it's just getting him to balance so he can stand. Yeah. So, All right. You know, uh, that's the end of this episode for Collector's Case Dark Horse for January. Let us know what you thought. So, yeah, not, this was the extra pop. That was the original pop because of his Funko. But it's not a pop, but whatever. Um, don't forget to subscribe, and thanks for watching. Thanks, guys.